I think the church gives uh, three uh, pillars <laughs> for the season of Lent. Prayer, fasting, and almsgiving. And, and so, however a person reflects in their own life in terms of how, you, how we live these out, in terms of prayer, most people are, uh, are, are much more reflective and prayerful during Lent. I mean, you just see oftentimes people say, making a commitment to, uh, to, to read something given them, uh, the little black book every day, and, and taking some time to pray and reflect. Some people uh, just say, I'm gonna go to Mass a couple extra times uh, a, a week or a month uh, during the Lenten season as a reminder of, of growing as a person of prayer. Uh, fasting, uh, you know, people fast to lose weight. <laughs> uh, oftentimes people, fasting in Lent is, is backing away from things a bit, whether it's food or entertainment or, or whatever, uh, to, 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 to realize two things. One, how blessed I am, and two, to identify with the people around this world that don't have food, that don't have opportunities, that, that, that don't have the blessings we have. Uh, so th that's, that's a, a fasting. And then, then almsgiving. Uh, you know, it's, it's, it's not just giving money. Uh, that's, that's an easy way out at times, uh, just to send in a check for $25 and, and you know, wash my hands of, of, of that. Almsgiving is, is really attentiveness to other people in their needs.